So EA dropped an 86 plus Ultimate Dynasty Team of the Group Stage or Winter Wildcard player pick. Let's open up a bunch of these and hopefully get some decent cards. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. Now it is one of four, but this is an 84 and an 85 rated squad. That's a bit too expensive for my liking. However, maybe they're just absolutely insane. Let's see what we get in the first one on my account. What are we getting, EA? Ugh. I mean, Bow would have been okay. It's not going to be another day of just Zidane every single player pick, is it? I'm going to take Geraldo Becker in this scenario. I don't know why. I just want to take Geraldo Becker. So I'm going to take Geraldo Becker. I don't want Zidane in my club. Um, and this card's whatever. I'm never going to use it. That is terrible. Not a great start at all. And then straight on to my second account to open the pick and see if we can get something better than Zidane. That's, we just don't want, I just don't want it to be filled with Zidane's, really. All right, here we go. Next one. So it's a bit better. At least the highest rated card's 88 this time. Still not great. We're not off to a flyer of a start. Let's just say that. All right, Lala's 86 plus. Let's see what he gets in his player pick, in his party bag. Enzo would have been pretty cool. I don't know if he's expensive anymore. Would have been pretty cool. He's got a Lamella that I forgot even came out. I genuinely don't remember that Lamella card coming out. And he's got uh, Ziyech as well. So, not great, basically. It's basically a pick between two 86s. All right, we have got Dan's 86 plus. He's got an 85 plus player pick two as well. All right, 85 plus pick first. 87 Maggle. I, I think this week will go down. As such a forgetful week within FC24. It's such a boring week because of how bad the pack weight has been. All right. 86 plus pick now. What are we saying? Oh. Tell you what. Dan will be very happy with that. Dan is a massive Arsenal fan. So he will be very, very happy with Winter Wildcard Saliba right there. That is very good. For the first, for the first time, actually... A card that really suits somebody as well. Because he's an Arsenal fan. So, 250k. You take that. That's a big W. All right. We've got Jack's 85 plus pick and 86 plus party pick as well. I'll tell you what. Saliba's not bad. Saliba is decent. Let's continue with that good luck. 88 Bruno Fernandes. Go on, Bruno. Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. 86 plus. Come on. Someone really good, please, EA. Eh, that Nico Williams card ain't bad, actually. I believe when it came out, it was actually quite expensive. He's taking Boniface anyway, but Nico Williams would have been okay, I think. I'm pretty sure when he came out, it was actually, it was actually a little bit pricey. He's still 225k, so I'm surprised he didn't take him. All right, we've got Ashley's party bag pick next. Come on. Let's get something good. Jonathan Klaus. I think that's a high, like, joint highest rated card we've had so far, right? I don't think he's expensive either. It's an okay card to have in the club if you want to eventually build out, but I think I think I've hit this this topic a few times in in these videos, right? Where EA have kind of removed the like collection esque area of this game. Back in the day, people would collect cards like that because obviously we'd get one league objectives and things like that, um, and there's no like need to collect cards anymore. So, as someone like Klaus there, although Klaus is decent, if he doesn't get into your team, he is literally just fodder. Whereas in previous years, I know a lot of people that we've opened share plays for and stuff have had clubs full of random special cards that they don't want to sell because they've got sentimental value because of the collectability. And it's just not, it's just not there anymore. And I think, I, I, I can't remember who it was, but someone tweeted me that and it really helped me articulate how I felt. Because I've said a few times in these videos that I miss the like icon swaps nature of it and that's what i miss i miss the collection aspect of the game i miss collecting cards all right we've got scotty do's pick next apparently apparently class is all right actually so fair enough a full winter wild card pick this time um sadly they're all not great uh that class is about 300k to be fair so class is actually pretty decent um i was maybe a little bit harsh but i just think it's because a lot of like I guarantee so many people did like Cafu, for example. So getting a right back is just not that exciting. All right, we're doing the 1K store pack for Reuven because he's actually got these from winning the PlayStation tournament. So fair enough. Oh, items before we can move forward. Got the 86 plus pick first as well. So the party, party pick first. Ooh, cheeky little Courtois. Very nice. Is he still expensive? That might be the best card we've had so far. No, he... 
When I packed him, when he was out, he was like 800k. That's why I had it in my brain that he's expensive. I mean, 100k is still decent, but I think Klaus is still the most expensive by a good good margin. But half-time foundations pack now for Reuven. Let's see what he gets. A gold card. It's going to be Spanish. Centre mid, Putellas. Go on, be Putellas. Why not? Be Putellas. It's Pathali, Guajaro, and Oblak. At least you've got a bit of fodder. You know? Modric, Mignon. I'll tell you what. A lot of walkouts there for 1 KFC points. You, you're not complaining too much there, actually. That's all right. That's not bad. All right, we've got Ethan's party pick next. Let's see if Ethan can get himself something decent. Fingers crossed. Come on, EA. Let's get our first, like, team of the group stage in Bappe ever, you know? Something like that. Come on. There's a few familiar faces right there. Lamella is definitely in the rotation today, isn't he? Lamella is 1 million percent in the rotation. So, winter wildcards, for example... You've got Putellas, Salah, Ronaldo, Van Dijk. All four of those are very good. Nkunku, solid. Um, Martinelli was an SBC. Those top, that top four is very, very good, though. That top four is very, very good. Then in terms of team of the group stage, you've got Mbappe, Bakayo Saka, Griezmann. Muziala's okay still as well. Uh, Barella's solid. Cancelo's decent. Bellingham's very, very good. Rodrigo's an SBC, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Rafael Leao. Some good cards there as well. Um, and then in terms of dynasties, I mean, there's, there's not as many great dynasties, is there? Um, but in terms of dynasties, you've got Erling Haaland. You've got uh, Lucas Hernandez. You've got Reese James. You've got Teo Hernandez. You've got Fulham Mendy, who I forgot even existed. Never see him anywhere. Um, Rasmus Hoyland, Kefram Taram, you know. Oh, and that's an SBC, my bad. All right, let's run my 85 plus player pick and not get a road to the final because they don't exist in packs at all. But let's open it anyway. 88 Bernardo Silva. It could have been a lot worse. That could have been a lot worse. We'll take Bernardo Silva. All right. Waza is opening an icon pick. He saved this from uh, before. Or it's just, open, it's just completed, should I say. Let's see what the icon pick's saying. Do you know what? Winter Wildcard Drogba is actually really good. That is actually solid, to be fair. Winter Wildcard Didier Drogba. We'll take that. That's solid, man. Four star, five star. Decent card. And he's worth... A solid million coins. Million coins. That is fantastic, man. Absolutely take that. That is solid. GG's. Get in there. That is a huge W. All right, we have Mike's campaign pick next. Let's see if we can get him something good. Come on. Sadly not. Is she five star, five star? Is this? Yeah, she is. Still not good enough. Sadly, five star, five star is not good enough to save that card, unfortunately. So uh, it's a another terrible player pick. Another another Lamella as well. Another Lamella. All right, we go again. Will we get our first? I don't know. Million coin plus pool? No. Barardi, it's okay. The thing is, there's like in terms of winter wild cards, is that that four chunk that you want that we looked at earlier? And if it's not one of those, you just don't care. Then obviously there's other ones in different different areas, but yeah, that's uh, that's tough. We're doing my 383 times tens on my second account. I'm gonna save them on my main account for future stars. I advise uh, a lot of you guys to save them because I just don't think Road to the Final is that great of a promo to open them. That being said, watch me go and get Road to the Final in one of these now. Um, so I'm gonna open them on my second account just for the content, but I'm gonna save them on the main. And I think we've got Pop in the first one. So Pop 88. I've got to discard it and recover her. Um, it would have been great if it was Team of the Year still, you know. Little cheeky 13th one, pop. Second one now. No special card again. It's going to be English goalkeeper. That can't be good. Pope. That's 84 rated. Yeah, nice. Thanks, EA. That's awesome. Very happy about that. That's really, really cool. Third and final one. Here we go. Come on. No special card again. <sighs> Erdegaard, the most common walkout for me this year, I think, actually has been Erdegaard. Um, Erdegaard or Trent? Yikes, not a great one. At least we got a walkout that time, but they were pretty bad. All right, we've got Harry's player pick next. Let's see what Harry gets. 
Dabinia? I saw a few people getting Dabinia, actually. I mean, she's okay if you didn't do the SBC. She's practically the exact same as the Team of the Year HM, bar, like, one stat in each stat, really. And she's 5-star, five 5-star, five so it's not awful. It's just not super exciting. I've got 3,000 FC points. Let's just blast them on these uh, 86 plus foundations packs and get one walkout in each. Yeah, Jude Bellingham, brilliant. I'm just going to store them in the club and then discard the rest because they're tradable. You never know. Mbappe, Golden Mbappe is still 1.7 million coins, you know? Just say, I'm just saying, EA. I'm just, I'm just, I'm, I'm not saying much. I'm just saying. Double walkout? No. I wonder if you, I wonder how, like, difficult it actually is to get a double walkout in these because, like, it literally is 186 and the rest of them are, like, 82 rated cards. Um, but out of three, we have had two singular walkouts. Is that Rod? Go on, double. Hey! Go on, double walkout. Sadio Mane. Flipping heck, that hairline's getting bad, isn't it? Sheesh. Go on, Sadio Mane. Double walkout. That's exciting. Get in there. We love that. 